uh, just doing a quick review on uh, this fantastic unusual wagon set from Trix 24008 got, got this off uh, eBay off one of my favourite sellers um, fantastic guy offers me stuff, unusual stuff at good prices and uh, snap this up um, what I like about it is it's half barge boat half wagon train so it breaks up into sections um, floats on the water and goes into barge long barge boats like that which interconnect that's the unloading mechanism for that someone's made on a model layout somewhere probably be a trick site I'll show a quick video of how they unload in real life in a minute. But well, first of all, I'll just take the lid off. And it's from the Fire and Water series, which has that badge on the top left. Yeah, so I've got a lid off. You get your pre molded top layer lid, which um, fits very snugly around the wagons when, when they've been packed because of really fine detail on these wagons um, fantastic detail I'll get them out of the box properly in a minute they've never been used you get your instruction book telling you how they operate and the history of the wagons They're called pipe wagons um, operation around 1950 plus area yeah so that's what they look like Like bathtubs designed to float and on the models are held together with a magnet on the middle and they uh, come apart left and right and they can float in pairs if you've got a real uh, river on your model railway system which is highly unlikely but it is very good how they're designed to work like the real prototype I think Yeah, so you can see the water level indicators on the side. Yeah, so I fill the plastic bowl of water. This is just completely bizarre because I said I wouldn't do this, but I had to try it to see whether they actually work like a prototype, and they do. They float perfectly, and they float exactly on the same amount, the exact water line level, everything, as the real prototype wagons. As you can see, make sure I don't drop my phone in the water. You can see the water level. I'll just knock it about a bit, see. There you go, you can see the water level. Exactly where it should be. So yeah, they do float. Floating wagons. Also the low compartments are individual. They slide out and on the end of each load there's a metal weight screwed on to give the wagon some uh, decent weight when it's travelling around on the track so it doesn't derail which is really cool 